Hi everybody, it's me Jeanette, Mothers Who Empower Other Mothers. So, I am actually pulled over right now. I decided to just post a video. I don't know, just I'm just doing it random. So it's okay, I think outside the box, have a discussion, ask questions, I really don't care. So, um, I am in my dating stage and it's very interesting. I kind of don't know where this is going right now, but I know one of the guys that I am definitely going to marry. I know for a fact I'm going to marry. Does he want to marry me? Uh, I think so. I think so. But here's the issue. I'm dating some out, outstanding, outstanding, and I'm not just talking about sexual, okay? Don't get no ideas, but it's okay if you got that idea in your head, then whatever, go with the wind. So, I'm actually dating a couple of guys, and I am so in tune with how they act and how they treat me. Number one, if you can make me laugh, because I am like the most silliest, but at the same time, I'm the most serious. And I'm going to laugh after I just said that. So bear with me. So anyway, so uh, I said number one. Number one, if you can make me laugh and keep a smile on my face, oh, we are, we can be best buds. Like, I can open up to you. I can understand your sense of humor. All right, next thing. Number two. Number two. Um, do not judge me. I am not perfect, I am not God, and I am not a saint. You know, I don't mind getting dirty. But anyways, <laughs> that's either, <laughs> just anyways. So, um, that being said, so I said, number one, if you can make me laugh and keep a smile on my face, we are, we are best bros, okay? Number two, you will not judge me because, once again, I'm just me. Okay, um, number three, I love men who are down to earth. They don't live in la la land. They set goals, they have a potential, and they also have a good drive. And I mean a good drive. Like if I see you and I know you're working, okay, yes, I can, you know, kind of, um, what's the word, like kind of be annoying at times. And I'm just saying that because that's just me. You know, I'm probably thinking about you. I probably miss you. And you crossed my mind a couple of times. So I might throw a couple of texts here and there, flirt with you, try to flirt with you. Um, I may call you just so you know that I did call. So you can't say I didn't call because I'm one of those people that text a lot. So I just want to make sure that you either see that I called or I want you to know that um, I'm thinking about you. So those are just different things that I... Um, I deal with while I'm dating. So um, we're gonna go to number four. So number four, he likes to take me out. He's not afraid to be around me. He's not afraid to um, introduce me to people because once I am the most respectful, I'm very funny, I'm cool, I'm laid back. I know when and not to talk. Because some men can't handle women that talk too much. Okay? All right. So, that's one. Um, that's number. That was number four. And I'm going to go with now number five. So, number five, um, he's able to open up to me. Oh, my God. That is like the most beautiful thing a man can do is open up his heart to a woman. Um, he may not necessarily be falling in love, but the fact that he can open up to me and he can talk to me and express how he feels, um, either be good or bad. And I will take in what I can and I will try my best to not be a, um, not be a burden to him or any type of, you know, negative energy, um, given out okay like me i'm i'm a very positive person so i like positive people i like people who are happy i like people who are um 
who strive to do strive to be successful and can um, balance their life now me dating and me dating multiple people some people find that very hard and very difficult to do but for me I find it okay and I can balance and um, since I have found like a connection with a couple of guys that I'm seeing I am okay I'm okay as long as you don't harm me as long as you're ha you make you can make me happy um, if you do things that are like not what I expect then I will slowly pull away or cut you off completely that's just me um, I love my peace I love my comfort I love to be happy I like to have a good time and enjoy myself so um, those are just the things that I just I just pinpointed just a couple of things that I actually enjoy um, with dating and I'm excited I'm dating uh, to soon maybe in the future to get married so whenever I'm ready and whoever it is you know to be with then that's what I'll take um, I'm not I'm picky but to an extent and um, we all have flaws we all have things that we need to work on as individuals and I do my best to take care of me first you know I make sure that I'm happy so when I come to you you're like oh my gosh she's always so happy she's in good spirits. she's you know um, she handles herself well okay yeah um, I do you know sometimes I do have to find that peace of mind to um, to get pull myself back together so I can be me and so that I can be the best of me so that being said me dating I love it okay yes I want to be married but hey guess what I am NOT rushing I am NOT rushing I'm gonna enjoy my life and I'm gonna do what makes me happy so I don't know if any other mothers here you guys watching the videos um, when you date and <clears throat> excuse me and when you date and you feel frustrated all the time like take a moment maybe right now is not the time for you if you feel overwhelmed when you date it's supposed to be smoothly it's about getting to know the person you're dating getting to know you and what you what you expect and what you um not say i don't want to say tolerate but what you expect and what you want out of that relationship so if you see warn if you see red flags okay take it for what it is it is what it is if you see something that turns you off okay right then and there either you can talk about it with that person say hey I'm not kind of feeling this type of thing and talk about it you know if not then um if not then just um I'm sorry I just like seen a red bird and I just thought it was so beautiful but anyways I'm gonna get back on subject so if you see things that you don't like you talk about it okay express um, the only way you would know about certain things is when you communicate communication is key communication is key being honest is key um, trusting is key um, being able to get out that box because none of us are alike but I believe that in life you will find and you will have a soulmate. Either that soulmate, yes, you may marry. That soulmate, you may not marry. But the fact that you have met that person um, comes to play with how you deal with things and your dating life. So take it for what it is. Enjoy dating. Um, if you're not happy, take a moment for yourself and just get yourself together you know um, there's no there should be no rush no hurry you know um, I like dating I like getting to know different people they um, just uh, it's it's amazing it's amazing so thanks for watching my video today be sure to like subscribe and comment below and tell me what you think of my video um, it might have been a lot but I hope you guys enjoy this. Thank you and have a blessed day. Bye.